Hi, Lou Manfredini, Aces Home Expert, and in this video, we're gonna show you how to clean a granite kitchen countertop. I'm here with Lenny Sherino, the president and CEO of Granite Gold. You make a terrific line of cleaners, polishers, sealers, even a disinfectant. When we're talking about granite countertops, that while that's a blanket statement, not all the stone is the same. Correct, so with granite, there's different porosities and densities. Some are a lot harder than others in terms of absor absorption. So with like say black absolute, right? Pretty common one. It, you barely need to seal that product. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of lighter color stones, the Jalo St. Cecilia's that um, you need to seal more often. So it's kind of a rule of thumb, the darker the stone, the denser? Generally for granite, yes. Okay. Yeah. Now a mistake that a lot of people make is they use regular household cleaners on granite and that can uh, actually etch the stone, take the finish off. Correct. Your daily cleaner is one that is pH balance and you can use every day. Absolutely, so ordinary household cleaners damage stone and it does two things, it actually wears the finish. So this is a natural polish, kind of thing like a polish in a diamond. Right. So the polish on here is not a coating, it's a natural polish of, of sanding and bringing it up to that, that high gloss. So when you actually use an ordinary household cleaner, it wears that finish. A lot of times you don't notice until down the road, you'll notice that your island is not as shiny as the rest of your countertop right. because you were using it more often and you're cleaning more often with the ordinary cleaner. And with your daily cleaner, applying it is just like any other cleaner, right? You spray it on and, and what do you use to wipe it off? So you just use a paper towel, you just spray and wipe. It's really easy to use, no streaks, and it's actually been tested on every type of stone. So a lot of products will come out and you know, ours is a neutral pH, but we test it on, because those absolute blacks that are really dense, a lot of products streak on it. Oh. So it's important to make sure it's safe on all types of stone, like marbles and travertines, um, but also the different types of stones, all, they all react differently. All right, you touched a little bit about sealer because that's something I think people are super confused about, but it's a very important uh, process to protect your countertop. So as a third generation fabricator installer, the sealer is what we do at the end of the job. That's the most important part. So what the sealer does, it creates a barrier. And when you spill wine, oil, whatever on there, it should just bead on the surface. Right. And that's actually a really good way to tell if it's been sealed, because we get the question all the time is, how often do I seal? How do I know to seal? And with granite, there's different types of porosity like I talked about before. So you just do a little two to three inches of water, let it sit on the surface, and it should beat on the surface. If it lays flat, if it darkens the stone, then you know it's time to reseal. And when you seal, always work in sections. Don't right. go spray the entire countertop right. down. Spray like a three foot section, really wet the surface, take like a terry cloth, work it into the stone, flip that cloth over, buff until dry, and then move on to the next section. You offer a polish that really can uh, bring the luster and, and something that can help preserve your uh, granite counter. Talk a bit, little bit about that. Yeah, you walk in and you'll see a, a, you know granite cleaner here, granite cleaner there, but no one really has a polish. And when we're finished installing a job, we actually, that's the kind of the wow factor product. Right. So we, we put this polish on there. When you think of a polish, you always think of like a car wax. You gotta put it on, you gotta buff it dry. Right. With this, it's a really easy spray and wipe formula with a paper towel. And it really puts a shine on there, it resists fingerprints, but more importantly, you can slide the bottle right across the yeah. countertop, which is really cool. Uh, the three products we just spoke about are, are terrific for daily usage and, and regular maintenance, but what about disinfecting a countertop? This is something that a lot of people are focused on. Absolutely, and we actually get that question a lot right now. Is uh, There's a lot of disinfectants out there, and a lot of them are harmful to stone because they fall in that ordinary household cleaner category. Right. So with our product, the Microgold, this is a multi-action disinfectant and antimicrobial. And what that means is most disinfectants, when you spray it, it kills, and then once you touch it, it's reinfected. Mm -hmm. So what our product has is what's called a Psyquat antimicrobial. And what it does, it bonds to the surface and creates what's called a biostatic barrier. So it continues to work after it dries. And that's the kind of the, the wow factor about that product. And our product is also a neutral pH and it's on the lowest toxicity level of the EPA. So it's safe to use on stone. That's great. Yeah. And that's it. If you'd like more information, go to acehardware.com. Follow us on our YouTube channel or better yet, stop by your neighborhood Ace Hardware store because Ace is the helpful place.